Hier, den erkenne ich von der Selektion wieder. Na ah, nein. Noch davor, Bobby. Der Nachtzug. Meine Güte, ja, du hast recht. Zu einem Abzeichen zu ist ein Amerikaner und ein Anarchist, hä? Ein Amerikaner? Gut. Sofortige Liquidierung von ihm und allen Insassen von Block 4. Das sollte eine eindrückliche Warnung sein für all die Schweine, die an einen Auftrag gedacht haben. Alarmieren Sie an Faust. Jawohl, Herr Kommandant. Dabei muss ich aber nicht dabei sein, oder? Der Gestank dieses Ortes, ne? Mach, was du willst. What were you thinking, you stupid idiot? Open the garage door, steal a vehicle, and crash through the gate. Let's go.
enough of that roof, I will go inside the garage and open the gates! No. No. Hey! I'm opening the gates, Mr. Blaskovich! Protect them, Mr. Blaskovich! No, no, no. Not the truck, not the truck! Take that vehicle, but wait for us! We will lead the way! <laughs> What is he doing? Come here! We're living now! leaves my cat. Oh, hate to make compliments, but I might have underestimated the usefulness of your ape-like physique, Mr. Blaskovich. 
Dad, you should. Tell me, what is it? Das Yuchud is an ancient, mystical society. For millennia, we have operated with utmost secrecy up until right now. What do you do? Do you pray? Do no, no, Mamale, we don't pray. We invent things, Mamale. The technology developed by Das Yuchud is centuries ahead of anything you've ever seen or imagined, and highly dangerous in the wrong hands. And the Nazis found our safety. They stole our secrets. They used them to win the war. Everything they have accomplished, everything was built upon our knowledge. But it wasn't our only safekeeper. We have hundreds of them hidden in the secret places of the world. Hundreds, some small and tentative like the ones the Nazis found. Others, great halls of knowledge stacked high, magnificent inventions, things that to you seem like magic. Now, I can open for you the gates to such a place. Getting there will be a challenge. What will it take? Well, the safekeeper's hidden deep below the Atlantic Ocean. We will need a U-boat capable of great depths, that's all. Stealing a goddamn Nazi U-boat? This is what you're proposing? Are you off your head, man? I know how to get a U-boat, but for my plan to work, I need this thing operational. Can you do it? I'm an Amadas Yichud engineer. I can do this in my sleep. Good. We would need some additional features on it, too. I will prepare a specification for you. Blaskovich, help him out, sir, if you'd be so kind. Hmm? Oh! oh say you good, say you good. Oh, Mr. Blaskovich, I will need some welding equipment, please. Sid. Yes. I'm trying to figure out what exactly you were doing in this organization of yours. Was it some kind of supernatural engineering? Supernatural. We don't believe in things supernatural, Mama. We believe in God. The Das Yichud is 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 a. It's a philosophy. It is a way of understanding God through knowledge. It is based on pure reason, pure rational thought, not supernatural bobkiss. Huh. Hmm. So everything you have created, what were you planning on using all that stuff for? No, you don't understand, Mama. It is, well, there was never any purpose or intent of use beyond the act of creation. We create to commune with God. Do you see that? You've lost me. It's like mathematical equations. Oh, go on, go on, Madele. And each solved equation brings you closer to God. Mm. But never intended to be used. No, the, the act of creation itself is the intended use. Oh, Tazui, Madele, she has something cooking in that Chinese of hers. Uh, do you appreciate the, 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 the distinction? Mamala, the safekeep I'm about to reveal to you is not a treasure chamber. It is a deep geological repository uh, protecting some of our most dangerous creations for the sake of the outside world. The purpose already served. Do you see that? Whatever helps the cause. Oh, you got it.
still got it, old man. when we got back. It's not worth much, but it's all I have left of him. My dear Sebastian. Someone's been studying up on helicopters. Captain Blaskovich, thank you. Thank you for leading me back to my wife. I had lost her. I have lost so many. Mr. Blaskovich, can you obtain for me some welding equipment?
for that big guy. Blaskowitz, they call him. Apparently, he spent the last 14 years in a, in a madhouse. I heard he was hospitalized after an injury. But that would explain a lot, wouldn't it? You'd have to be crazy to break into both Eisenwald and Belitza. And make it back alive. I think he's brave. Brave and crazy. You want Blaskowitz. Looking for the welder. You seen it? No, I don't think so. Oh, wait a minute. No, you're right, you're right. I was meaning to sort out the railing over by the secret fountain entrance. Fucking thing fell out of my hand into the water. I'm a bit busy at the moment, but you want the welder, you go right on ahead and start swimming. The door to the secret fountain entrance is in the main room behind the table. Go over there and you should find the welder somewhere down in the water somewhere. in your back it hurts so fucking much you want to stab your own eyeballs out with whatever utensils with an arm's reach just for a wee moment's distraction no i'm doing fine really <laughs> fucking christ almighty that looks incredibly inefficient fergus why do you need my help no i'm fine good did you ever stop to realize that the past, present, and future are the same equation for all people and all things, hmm? The calculations have already been made and they are not going to be changing, given all the variables and, and the proper methodology, obviously, of course. All future events are as predictable as the sunrise. Are you following this? Aye. What will happen will happen, eh? Is this what you're telling me? Oh, I suppose, if naively described by a complete idiot. Well, I'm working the math, Mr. Fergus Reed. I know things about the future. You people are merely wandering the darkness, utterly ignorant as to whether the sun will rise tomorrow. So tell me, Professor, are we going to win this fight? Are you attempting to anger me? Can you even begin to comprehend the volume of data I would require to perform such a calculation? I could fill the whole of Berlin with variables on variables and still have nowhere near... Why am I even explaining this? It's just a waste of time. I can tell you that Captain William Joseph Blaskovich has an impact on some, on some larger threats. Oh, really now? How did you manage to gather all the variables to reach that conclusion, hmm? Might it have something to do with his ability to execute missions never before dreamed of? Or perhaps it's his ability to remain calm under the most disturbing of circumstances. Or it could be his incredibly attuned sense of aggression. No! Wait, I've got it. I've got it. It could be the fact that he's the biggest goddamn Nazi killing machine ever to walk the planet Earth. Yeah? I could have performed that calculation with my ass. There you go again, provoking me for no reason! By the way, you should stack the crate short end facing the door if you care about space optimization. He doesn't. Nobody ever cares about important things. If we're going to steal a Nazi U-boat, I need set repairs that thing on the table. 
help him with his work, will you? Sorry, pal. Don't mean to, you know, derail your train of thought, but uh, I need to get through that door. Ag, please. What I think about, I'd rather not think about. <laughs> that bad, huh? Jay would think that when Jay seen what I have, your mind would break like an egg. How come it has not? Well, maybe it has begun already and I just don't know it. <laughs> World changing. No matter who you are or what you're made of. Thing is, you and me, we just gotta ride the whirlwind. Make it through to the other side. And kill all the Nazis? <laughs> and kill all the Nazis. I would drink with you in celebration, Veneer, that time comes. You're on. Mm -hmm.